High profile violent crimes like the murder of a UNM baseball player have people concerned. Today, a city councilor unveiled another step to get the problem under control, putting half a dozen bicycle officers along part of Central Avenue. News 13's Madeline Schmidt is live in Knob Hill with the story. Yeah, well, Kim, between this and the state police officers that have been assigned to Albuquerque, it's all just puzzle pieces trying to fix the crime problem here. But community members, like, for example, this business owner who was just hit by thieves yesterday, are understandably anxious for change. The criminals in this area are just getting ridiculously out of hand. 27 years in Knob Hill, but business owner Robert Steinberg says none have been as concerning as the last few. This used to be a really nice, safe, quiet, peaceful, hip area, and just more and more, it just seems like, you know, the criminal elements taking over. Yesterday morning around 8, he tells us this man tried to break into his shop on Central near Morningside in Eastern Knob Hill. The perp was not successful, thankfully, but he still did some damage. He symbolizes a much bigger problem in this area, crime people and businesses affected. We need a lot more police officers in Knob Hill. And most important, we need judges that lock people up that are career criminals. Earlier today, this is totally just for Southeast. City Councilor Pat Davis announced that bicycle officers like Steve Weinstein are officially patrolling the International District and Knob Hill, trying to get ahead of the crime by community policing. You're going to see a lot more officers in your neighborhood, whether they're on bikes or whether they're patrolling or able to stop and get out and walk a business beat for a while. Um, and that's how we're going to start making progress again. It's all about making relationships with all kinds of community members. For instance, yesterday we, we were able to, um, we saw someone sitting in an alley. Uh, my partner and I were able to, to ride right up to him and, and just have like an open conversation with him. But these officers can make arrests too if need be. And Robert Steinberg is anxious to see their presence pay off. Sure, it's in the right direction, but I think we need even more. Now, the bicycle officers focus on hot spots, and right now they're putting their attention towards Central and Wyoming, but they will go all up and down Southeast Central, including right here in Knob Hill. Kim, back to you.